Anyone else wish there was a dislike button on Twitter? YouTube. Well, we have one on YouTube. Why are you always lying? Honestly, there are videos like this that shouldn't even have the option to dislike. Yeah, well, now we can't dislike any video. Yay, YouTube! Getting rid of things nobody asked to get rid of! Woo! <laughs> America's ugliest Confederate statue isn't coming down anytime soon. Oh, wow, that is an ugly statue. But just a few hours ago, the statue was taken down. Which is kind of fair. I mean, because look at the statue. Statue. Have you seen that thing? It's freaking horrifying. Must see TV Thursday. Kramer. Will he say it? Oh, he said it all right. Oh, he, he said it a lot. <laughs> if you organize an illegal rave, you can be fined up to $10,000. Tweeted by the UK Prime Minister. See, you know, this would be fine if it wasn't for the fact that information has leaked that the government had a secret Christmas party while the whole country was in lockdown and people were unable to see their loved ones. Ooh, that, that's not a good look. Hollywood producer Ryan Kavanaugh praised Harvey Weinstein for being a survivor. Brilliant creative mind. Never underestimate Harvey. He is a survivor. I mean, of all people, I mean, oh God, this just aged terribly. Oh yes, the New York Society for the Prevention of Cruelty to Children's 2013 Spring Luncheon. Oh, ho, ho. you see, at this event, Ghislaine Maxwell was a guest. She is on trial for cruelty against minors. So yeah, I mean, she probably shouldn't have gotten an invite. YouTube CEO, promising to improve their platform and become more transparent in 2020. <laughs> okay, come on. Did we really believe that they were gonna do that? Yeah, no, I didn't think so either. Vosh. The left needs a big streamer who isn't known for using racial slurs. I'm stepping up to the plate. A few moments later. Never mind, they banned me for using racial slurs. Ah, you were so close, Vosh. <laughs> the streamer Vosh commented on the ban of the leftist streamer Hasanabi. Hassan was banned for using the word cracker. Oh God. Am I gonna get banned too? Whatever. Shortly after, Vosh talked in his live stream about the band and used the word as well. But it was in context of talking about slurs itself. For this, Vosh also was banned. Hey, you can't win them all, my friend. There's no need to fear. Poland is prepared for any type of invasion. Do we even need to read this? Newsflash, they were not prepared for any type of invasion. Is 16 gigabytes of RAM enough? 32 gigabytes may be the future, but we sure as hell aren't there yet. Oh lord, I hope RAM becomes cheaper then. Especially if 32 gigabytes becomes the standard. Eh, it almost always does, barring a disaster that disrupts production. Someone left a comment in 2019 saying that the PC RAM should get cheaper in the future barring a disaster that disrupts production. And well, since 2020, all kinds of chip shortages have affected RAM prices and mostly increased their costs. Yeah, you hear that, Amoeba? You jinxed us, you jinxed us all, man. The shockingly convincing argument that Severus Snape is transgender. On Tumblr, a community of Harry Potter scholars have spent years poring over the fantasy series, and some have come to the only possible conclusion. The potions professor is a transgender woman. <laughs> you see, it's funny because JK Rowling, the author of the book, is, is transphobic and, and therefore would not write a transgender character, probably not, no. But it, it's a nice theory, I like it. Beautifully animated Ratatouille can't pass reviewer smell test. So basically this film critic believed that Pixar's latest movie Ratatouille was a poor release, and then it ended up being critically acclaimed instead. Yeah, definitely not a good call. The tornado that destroyed Mayfield, Kentucky and killed 100 plus people. Yeehaw, grab a six pack and a lawn chair. There's a tornado coming. Oh, Bethany, no, it, it wasn't one of those tornadoes. November is gonna be a great month to be a gamer. Oh yeah, the Grand Theft Auto Trilogy Definitive Edition, Battlefield 2042, Call of Duty Vanguard, and Forza Horizon 5. Yeah, well that was posted the month before, and now two of those games on the list have two of the lowest ratings in game history, making this post pretty cheese in terms of aged milk. John Cena, live a life, not an apology. John Cena gave an apology in Mandarin to the Chinese government after implying Taiwan was an independent country. Yeah, which is it, John Cena? Apologize or don't apologize? I, I can't tell. But to be fair, that's not really on John Cena. It's pretty much China putting a gun to his head and basically being like, apologize. This Mother's Day, get back to the job that really matters. Mr. Clean, oh, oh gosh. Jeez, Mr. Clean is a bit of a chauvinist. Mother Nature versus Capitalism. Serge Tankian of System of a Down, a socially conscious band, announces his new NFTs, something that goes against what his music stands for. Yeah, man, screw capitalism. Uh, oh wait, I, I can make some money? Well, well okay, well, I take that back 
back for when I make money, but, but then after that, screw capitalism. Hopefully Kellogg's treats their employees fairly so we can continue to enjoy our favorite breakfast cereals. Originally, this post was hopeful that Kellogg's and the union would reach an agreement. However, Kellogg's just fired all workers and are planning to hire completely new workers. This is an outcome few would have expected in labor relations between a union and a company, and probably the most extreme outcome I would have imagined. The snow scene in The Wizard of Oz used 100% pure asbestos fibers for the snow. <gasps> oh my god, they were using poison! <laughs> These poor characters! No wonder the Wicked Witch died! I took this photo on January 9th, 2020 in Boston. 2020 will probably be fine. Aw oh, no, you jinxed us! But it wasn't fine! Oh god, it wasn't fine! People who complain that YouTube might remove the dislike feature? <laughs> Intellectuals who realize that this would permanently lock YouTube Rewind at the most disliked video of all time. See, you know, you thought you were being smart, but uh, no, you played yourself. Yes, it's real. And a youth support. K-Y-S. Kapiti youth support. <laughs> I'm sure those kids feel so much better. This year is 2096. Global warming and World War III have thrown the Earth into a nuclear winter. The human race has been extinct, and yet somehow Supernatural has just been renewed for a 64th season. This humorous tweet was made back in 2018, mocking the fact that the TV series Supernatural had been running for over a decade and showed no signs of stopping. Supernatural's 15th season was confirmed to be its last and aired its finale on November 19th of 2020. And you know what I have to say about that show? Good riddance. That show was garbage, and if you're a fan of Supernatural and don't like what I say? I don't care, because I hated that show. I'm sorry, that show just gets me so mad, Dean in his stupid, gorgeous face. Anyways, next meme. If anyone ever gets around to writing a history of popular music, 1967 will surely be referred to as the year of Engelbert Humperdinck. I, I'm sorry, who? 1967 is now recognized to be one of the greatest years in music ever, and if any historian mentions Engelbert Humperdinck's name when talking about this year, it was because he was a schmaltzy middle-of-the-road singer who inexplicably managed to compete with the Beatles on the chart, widely acknowledged as the actual artist of the year. And yet, I have no clue who he is. I'm sorry, Humperdink. It's it's just not a really good name. Humperdink? I hardly know her, Dink. <laughs> okay, I'm leaving. By 2005 or so, it will become clear that the internet's impact on the economy has been no greater than the fax machines. Nobel Prize winning economist Paul Krugman. Oh, geez, Paul. Thanos should have snapped this quote away, because th this just ain't accurate. The pyramid guy from the opening credits literally has no significance to the show and never will. He's just a generic image made to look mythological or spooky, like most things in the intro. Oh, and the rest of Gravity Falls after this was created, Bill Cipher was in it a ton, and thus this aged like milk. He was wasn't just in it a ton, he was the show. But I gotta say, I did love theorizing about Gravity Falls while the show was like airing new episodes and everything, so I can't even blame this guy, he's just a theorist. But hey, that's just a theory. A easy peasy theory. And Matt Pat suing us. Next meme. <laughs> it can't happen here. We read books instead of burning them. It's World War II propaganda about how we read books instead of burning them. While in 2021, a school board is openly advocating burning books. Ah oh, gosh, is the world gone crazy? You know what, don't answer that. The answer is yes. Texas winters. You can never predict them. My favorite part of winter is watching it on TV from Texas. You see, that was true until you guys got an unusually cold winter and all of your power shut down. So, hey, who's laughing now? Oh, wait, no one. Here's a diet hint. Sugar just might be the willpower you need to curb your appetite. We now understand that processed sugars could be detrimental to your weight loss and metabolism. So, yeah, they were way off the mark with that one. The frick are you doing here, dude? Identify yourself. Who the frick are you? Oh, it's an old EDP. Clip. I would love this man as a security guard at my school. Oh. <laughs> oh, trust me, kid. You definitely don't want him at your school. Hey, guys, I'm just looking for cupcakes. Like, <laughs> This month, we celebrate the women of Activision and Blizzard. Wow, Activision Blizzard has been sued by the state of California, alleging that Activision Blizzard ignored and even allowed sexual misconduct to go ahead in their offices, with recent info stating that fridges were padlocked due to breast milk being stolen. Oh my gosh, these people are awful. He's basically like a high school hitter. MLB scouts believe Shohei won't be able to hit big league pitching. Shohei is a once-in-a-generation player, capable of throwing 100 miles per hour and hitting 
40 plus homers in a season. He recently won Most Valuable Player unanimously, the first player to do so since Bryce Harper in 2015. Being scouted as a high school hitter is a shockingly incorrect take. John Griffin just did the math. We have, count them, four stories about people abusing kids today. Three up now. If we're society's mirror, you people suck. This just in, CNN John Griffin arrested over abuse of underage girls. <laughs> oh, how ironic, you freaking monster. Enjoy jail. Dream tweets. Thank you for the totally unbiased two month, 29 page investigation into whether a 16th place run had too good luck. That was then made into a clickbait YouTube video by a head moderator. What a shocker. Mr. Beast. Dream right, other guy wrong. Carl. Vouch. Eric. Double vouch. Chris. Triple vouch. Uh, guys, I, I don't know if you want to vouch for Dream. I mean, he, he was caught cheating. So, you know what? Whatever. <laughs> This PC states that it was never obsolete, but the stats of the computer are dwarfed by even the low-end PCs these days. Uh-huh, never obsolete. Oh, yeah, no, that, uh, <laughs> that definitely looks obsolete. Some genius is doormat. <laughs> Come back with a warrant. And, uh, that's exactly what they did. <laughs> Police, open up! You might want to return that mat. On this day, 11 years ago. Why does Steve Jobs think that FaceTime video calling will be great? Nobody video calls. What an iPhone 4 fail. Oh, that is just awkward. Not only do people FaceTime all the time, but the original iPhone 4 design is the leading influence for the newest iPhone, the iPhone 12. It's kind of like a double fail. People who think that Dream cheats in his manhunt videos? Hmm? Burn. Yeah, but uh, <laughs> he actually did cheat, so uh. Recently in a paper view boxing match between Bryce Hall, pictured above, and Austin McBroom, Bryce got bodied and lost meaning that today was not his day. Bryce Hall, today is my day. Uh, are you sure about that? Cameron Payne was cut by the Chicago Bulls because they believed he couldn't play on an NBA level. Four years later, he's back in the NBA playoffs, just dropped 16 points in 19 minutes in game five, and is averaging 13 points per game off the bench for a contending team in the series. Safe to say that he can play on an NBA level. Well, not according to this article. We knew the second practice that he couldn't play at an NBA level. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the Bulls are gonna feel pretty stupid about that one. 10 years ago, there was only Space Jam with Michael Jordan, proving that he's the superior basketball player to LeBron James. Now there's a Space Jam 2 that features LeBron James on this day 10 years ago. Michael Jordan is so much better than LeBron. I mean, Michael Jordan was in Space Jam. Dang, that's tough. At one time, higher education did equate to the higher compensation. Now higher education has sunk Americans into 1.7 trillion in debt. Justification for higher education. A nice house, a nice view with a bunch of fancy cars. Actually, for a lot of people, you just kind of end up paying that debt for the rest of your life, uh, so. Woo, higher education, yay. I'm sorry, Flappy Bird users. 22 hours from now, I will take down Flappy Bird. I cannot take this anymore. Huh, step one, threaten to take it down. Step two, wait until everyone downloads it. Step three, profit. Huh, not fooling me. Actually, no, he wasn't trying to fool you. He legitimately took down Flappy Bird, and we have not seen it since 2014, so uh, how do you feel? Prince William speaks out. We are very much not a racist family. Racist royals? But Buckingham Palace banned ethnic minorities from office roles. Archives also shed light on Queen Elizabeth's exemption from race and sex discrimination laws. Ah, gosh, that is a bad look. You can't even justify that. You're like, no, no, we didn't hire ethnic minorities because, uh, ah, uh, we're racist. Can you imagine if during a heat wave, Texans were told to turn off their power, their appliances, and sit in the dark? That won't fly in the Lone Star State, and it shouldn't happen anywhere in our country. Texas politician bashes LA mayor for asking citizens to turn off appliances or save energy, claiming it wouldn't fly in Texas. Texas is now undergoing an energy crisis and is asking citizens to turn off appliances to save energy. Oh, you can't make this stuff up. It's just, it's clear as day. It's like, that won't fly in my Texas. Oh, what's that? It's gotta fly in Texas? Oh man. Never meet your idols. Oh, it's Taylor Swift. So they asked Taylor Swift, are there any artists you're dying to work with? And she says, I had this dream that Kanye West called me and I said, I wanna rap in one of your songs. Then I woke up and was really mad that it was just a dream. Okay, so if you don't know, Kanye West completely crashed Taylor Swift's award speech when she won a Grammy. Yeah, definitely not one of those heroes you should meet in real life. DDT is good for me.
DDT was an extremely effective insecticide, so effective that it ended up killing rats, mice, dogs, and being an environmental disaster. There is some evidence that it wasn't good for people either. It ended up being banned 20 years later, and the fuss about it is part of the foundation of the EPA. However, it is making a comeback as a potential use to fight off malaria since it is so effective. Just probably not going back into farms. Yeah, you know that whole song about how DDT is good for you? Yeah, no, it's not good for you, 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 you. It's not good for any of you. Be Kind to One Another by Ellen DeGeneres. Ah, uh, ha, ha, ha. Oh, Ellen, no, no, no. We all learned about you being a bit of a demon. Oh, ho, ho. 20 overhyped games that flopped. Gosh, I just hope that Cyberpunk never ends up in a list like this. Oh, buddy, 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 buddy. <laughs> That's exactly what happened, isn't it? More doctors smoke camels than any other cigarette. Yikes, okay. Can you just imagine a doctor coming in with a cigarette like, listen, Johnny, you gotta take care of your health better. <laughs> <laughs> Discord logo before Microsoft versus after Microsoft. This post from r slash Discord app was about how Microsoft would change their beloved logo. Only weeks after this, however, and Discord changed to the now hated by many logo. See, you just can't win. You don't like this one. You don't like the one that they changed it to. You know, nobody wins. Everybody loses. Galaxy Note 7 durability video. Flame isn't going to be a normal problem people have issue with. Ah yes, the Galaxy Note 7 durability. The Galaxy Note 7 became infamous for an exploding battery problem that led to a full recall and the device being deliberately bricked via update. Ah, what a shame. Yeah, so uh, my guess is that the Galaxy Note 7 is uh, not that durable. No, I don't think so. Gum ad from 1911. Do you want to know how to kiss a girl? Then learn. Stand facing her. Do not tell her your intentions. Do not ask for permission to kiss her. Look dreamily into her eyes. You may hold her right hand in your right hand if you wish. It is well to sigh a couple of times about this stage of the game. Whisper softly that her rosebud lips remind you of Cupid's bow. She will probably drop her eyes and blush when you say that. Place the fingers of your left hand under her chin and tilt back her head slightly. Draw her gently towards you. Do not hurry. Gaze deeply at the love lights which slumber in her eyes. Sigh once more and incline your head towards her until your lips... But wait! Do not kiss her until you know that she uses listerated pepsin gum. Okay, all of this is bad advice. I love the first two comments. Don't tell her your intentions and do not ask permission to kiss her. Yeah, good luck following those rules nowadays. You'll be in jail faster than you can say, buy Listerated Paps and Gum. Fall Guys will destroy Fortnite in 2021. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, that didn't work. Introducing Battleship. And the women are just cleaning in the background because, yeah, that that's a women's job, you see? Because this is a stereotypical 50s family. Ah, you see, while the women clean, we attend to manly business, you know, playing Battleship. <laughs> <laughs> the Nintendo Switch will be another failure by Nintendo. Oh, buddy, you, you should just delete this video. Definitely not the video you're gonna wanna keep on your channel. If a new Wario game gets revealed at E3 Direct today, I will follow everyone who replies to this tweet. It's funny because it's not gonna happen. And what do you know? It, it, it actually did happen. This was tweeted out before the Nintendo E3 Direct. During it, there was a trailer for a new WarioWare game, making it so they would need to follow through with their promise of following everyone. Ah, oh, that's unfortunate. Fortunate, but hey, a deal's a deal. 10 years ago, Amy Winehouse, please stay sober. I need your music. Oh, rest in peace. Yeah, that's actually really sad. ABC's top 10. The Church Ladies' new titles for Princess Diana. Number one, slut, slut, slut. Number two, slut. Number three, slut. Number four, Queen Orgasmia. And number five, Princess of Wales and Moans. Oh, goodness. The Dana Carvey Show was a sketch show that came on during primetime on ABC in 1996. It was one of the first first sketch shows to be run during prime time and pushed the limits of counterculture humor until it was canceled with just seven episodes in. In episode one, they performed a skit making fun of Princess Diana's perceived promiscuous activity, which was surely funny at the time. In 2021, Princess Diana is revered and beloved and speaking ill of her is poorly received. Yeah, so that definitely did not age well. Paul Krugman says, the growth of the internet will slow drastically as the flu blah, 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 blah. Okay, let me just stop you there. We all know that the internet's still here. It's alive and beautiful. That's why you're watching this video now, and that's why this guy is wrong. Next meme. Just a couple hours after posting this, the first person died by a lightning strike. The Washington Post reports that nobody has been killed by lightning in the United States this year. It's the first time the nation has made it this far into the year without a single lightning death. And then boop, somebody gets struck by lightning. Ah, how unfortunate. Miranda Cosgrove saying, I hated my feet. Miranda Cosgrove used to be a star in some shows created by Dan Schneider on Nickelodeon. And Dan Schneider 
is an infamous file with a foot fetish that worked his fetish into some of his shows. He'd have young girls showing their feet off or moments involving feet. Plus, he would even ask underage teens to post pics of their feet on Twitter. Yeah, this article really does not age well. But it's not Miranda Cosgrove's fault. No, no, no. Dan Schneider's just a creep. Official Xbox Magazine. Mario, Sonic, prepare for war. Blinks is here. Uh, I'm sorry, who? Blinks was Microsoft's response to the pop culture icons that were Sonic and Mario. Clearly, it wasn't a good response because who the frick is Blinks? Wired comes out with this article. What's next for Microsoft? 83 reasons why Bill Gates' reign is over. You see here, everybody thought that Bill Gates was gonna end. Meanwhile, he's over here putting microchips in our brain. So ha, joke's on us. And who knows, maybe I'll be a hero like Ellen. Oh, yeah, not sure if you want her to be your hero anymore, Hamilton. We've got to remember, this is a marathon, not a sprint. Gotta be measured how risky we go. Bono, copy Lewis. Wolf, absolutely agree, Lewis. Lewis Hamilton told his team not to take huge risks at the race restart when he was second in the race, with two laps to go in the race, because the championship is long and more important, then proceeds to lock up his tires into turn one and fall to the back of the grid. Oh, that's tough. Jeez, that's gotta be upsetting. PNG says, you can't cancel pride. A few moments later. Oh, uh, never mind. Do something that matters. Hashtag PG day one. Oh, PNG try to support gay rights only when it will make them a profit. When you start on their main Twitter page, it seems as if they're trying to support pride, but then you go to their Middle Eastern Twitter and it's clear that they're using pride as a flavor of the month. Corporations on Pride Month are like, oh yeah, no, we're totally inclusive. Uh, yeah, <clears throat> it's July 1st. Okay, scratch all that. Aw, when Mini Lad said, for my kids, everyone liked that. Uh, no, everyone did not like that. Sorry, if you don't know, Mini Lad has been caught talking to, uh, little girls, so, uh, let's just, uh, let's just not bring him up anymore. Is that fair? Also, Louis Caliber is weird too, so, yeah, both of those guys weird. Note to self, don't get in a golf cart or car or anything with Ryan Dunn driving, said by Bam Margera. In the Jackass Backyard special from 2002, Bam shares this quote with the camera that he will actively avoid getting into both golf carts and cars with Ryan Dunn while he's driving. Unfortunately, nine years later in 2011, Ryan Dunn died after getting into an accident while driving his Porsche at an excessive speed on the highway. Oh gosh, that is so creepy. Bam was kind of right. Lil Peep says, if you drink soda on the regular, don't tell me crap about my drug habits because you're going to die first, lol. Oh, okay, yeah, uh, rest in peace, Lil Peep. We're just going to keep moving on. Yep, Army Hammer. 2001 is going to kneel down before me and kiss my feet because this year I'm the boss of my own year. 2020 was a cheap shot no one was expecting. Now I know what we're up against and it's time to go to war. Know thy enemy, know thyself, and exploit the differences. Army Hammer is embroiled in a scandal in which he's accused of, um, vaping multiple women. One of the allegations includes a cannibalism fetish where he told a woman he wanted to eat her. Okay, well, yeah, I don't think 2021's gonna be your year. Matter of fact, the next 30 to 50 years might not be your year either, seeing as you might go to prison. And you know what? I actually don't feel that bad for you. Congressman Matt Gates is now under investigation for sex trafficking of minors and is the most well-known Gates now. And this is a daycare center now associated with that name. Now hiring Gates Kitty Care. Oh no, don't sign your kid up for this school, all right? You, you don't want their services. They aren't breaking terms of service though, because guess what? If they did, they would be banned, but they aren't. That screenshot doesn't prove anything. Since the hot tub category died, many streamers decided to make ASSMR the new meta violating terms of service. Yeah, so you know how you said, it's okay because they're not violating the terms of service because they're not getting banned. Well, yeah, now they're getting banned. So, uh, yikes. Man who would never kill himself and is later found to be a rich pedo is featured in a woman's magazine trying to get a date with girls. Oh, it's the bachelor of the month, Jeffrey Epstein. <laughs> Financial strategist Jeffrey Epstein, 27, talks to only people who make over a million a year. If you're a cute Texas girl, write this New York Dynamo at 55 Water Street. Yeah, whatever you do, please don't write this guy. I don't know what's sadder, the fact that this person put out an ad to get contacted by girls, or the fact that people probably contacted him. Australia, shooting cats, Australia's war on feral cats. You see, they had to kill the cats. It solves all their problems. Oh wait, mice plague overwhelms farmers in Australia. See, you know, you get rid of all the cats and then all of a sudden there's too many mice. Way to go messing up the ecosystem. Jewish refugees arrive in Palestine with a banner proclaiming, the Germans destroyed our families and homes. Don't you destroy our hopes. Oh no. <laughs> oh, this one's that, this is a loaded gun I'm holding on to. Let's just, next meme, please. Um, Jenny? What? We changed our minds, so we'll be your slaves. Great. Um, to those of you who don't know, this actress, perhaps most notably from Smallville, although I stumbled across this segment in Honey, We Shrunk Ourselves, became the second in command of a sex slavery cult next 
Nexivum. Nexivum? You know what? That's the cult name. I don't know how to pronounce it. Into which she recruited and or blackmailed women into sex or financial ruin with the cult leader Keith Ranier. These guys have such weird names. Some women were branded with Ranier's initials. Oh wow, that is uh, <laughs> that is very dark. But hey, honey, we shrunk ourselves kind of got it right. I mean, they're kind of reading the future. They might be the next Simpsons. Tell employers about your WAP. Uh, and it turns out here, uh, nine years ago in r slash jobs, WAP was uh, work attributes and personal. Macaroni in a pot. That's some. Work attributes personal. <laughs> Guardians of the Galaxy? Really? How many comics has this series sold? You need to be a hardcore Marvel fan to know about them. What about a good X-Men movie instead? I mean, they are the best of Marvel Universe. These comic book movies are mediocre at best. Yeah, Guardians of the Galaxy, who even knows about those guys? Apparently none of you guys realize how bad of an idea a touchscreen is on a phone. I foresee some pretty obvious and pretty major problems here. 2007, holy cow, dude. Internet may be just a passing fad as millions give up on it. Yeah, there's no way that's gonna take off. I mean, really? Everything you could ever wanna know in one spot? Get real. Yahoo Answers has honestly helped me so much with school. Yahoo Answers, my homework questions, answers from one decade ago. YouTube's brightest stars, the Dolan twins, Sean, D Sean Dawson, and David Dobrik. Ooh, man. 10 years ago, example, I'm on an Xbox, friend is on a PS3. Could we play together? That will never happen. This is actually incredible, and I still can't believe that there are people on PlayStation, Xbox, and Nintendo consoles playing together. That's just incredible. Reason not to pre-order Cyberpunk 2077? None. Uh, <laughs> if only you knew. Witness the beginning of a dark universe. This franchise was supposed to be huge, but the first movie flopped, and instead the whole planned franchise pretty much got canceled. Berserk is going to end soon. I know it's true. Just need to wait for the next chapter. Ah, yikes. Nokia, 1 billion customers. Can anyone catch the cell phone king? The mystery of billionaires is long marriages. It is remarkable how many of the super successful have stuck by their first spouse. <laughs> you never regret going to the gym. At Pure Gym, I am locked in one of your gyms. Rung all available numbers to be connected to voicemail and the manager said he's going to bed. Damn. Hefty girls wanted for police force. Women with brains plus good physique are wanted. The pay and prospects are good, but they must never marry or their career will end. Huh. Girls and guys, this is the book I'm reading right now. You should too. Hashtag always learning tagged some strong women I know. Feminist Fight Club, an office survival manual for a sexist workplace. Aviation is fine as a sport, but as an instrument of war, it is worthless. Right. Uh-huh. James Charles tweets, I've never done anything illegal, but every time I hear police sirens, I always look to make sure they're not pulling into my driveway. Uh, what what, what would you have to worry about then? Why why would you look to your driveway? When he was 26, Pistol Pete Amerovich said, I don't want to play 10 years in the NBA and die of a heart attack at age 40 in an interview. He went on to play 10 years in the NBA and died of a heart attack at age 40. I got to see Wonder Woman by myself weeks ago, so shut up, there's already been a man-only screening. Oh, and it's a goddamn delight. Gal Gadot replies, Lol, thank you so much. See you soon. After a few rumors from a month ago, Gal Gadot finally confirms that Joss Whedon threatened to harm her career on sets of Justice League and told her he would write her off the script. Oof. Japan expressing happiness about winning bid to host 2020, 2021 Olympics back in 2013. Ah, man. Marvel rolls dice, casts no names for Thor. Article talks about how risky it is casting no name actors Chris Hemsworth and Tom Hiddleston in their movie, who later go on to become extremely famous and well loved actors. Pouring old engine oil into the ground was recommended by popular science less than 60 years ago. Disposing of used engine oil can be a problem. Problem. Solution, dig a hole in the ground with a post hole digger and fill it with the fine gravel. Then pour in the oil. It will be absorbed into the ground before your next change. Cover the spot with soil. January 1963. Hmm. In a book about mundane but quote creepy things, five years before she came out, Bruce Jenner's face. There's something that happens to a man's face when he gets plastic surgery. He starts to look like a woman. R slash instant karma. Piece of shit assaulted two to three innocents then was put down and is now using his dad's money to act 
actively remove this video from the internet. Don't let it die. Removed by Reddit in a response to a copyright notice. Yikes. Derek Jackson, uh, I assume Jackson, healed together without hurting each other. Derek Jackson, the author of this book and a relationship expert, was revealed to have cheated on his wife about a month after its publication. Oh, man. Found this on a Nikocado, Avocado, and Orlin home video. Oh boy. I love how real you are. Don't act fake on camera. Keep making vids. Ah. Sonic says, If your profile picture is from an anime, your opinion doesn't count. Thank God Reddit doesn't have profile pics. <laughs> Uh, happy anniversary, Melinda Gates. I can't wait to spend 25 more years laughing together. 2019. Ooh. I'm out of a job. Loki dies in Infinity War confirmed? Uh, I doubt it. Nope. All right, Rowling. We get it, trans Harry. In March of 2019, it was revealed that English author J.K. Rowling, author of the Harry Potter series, had stated that Dumbledore, a character from the books, is gay, retroactively making him an LGBT character. People then started parodying the situation, leading to this highly upvoted meme suggesting a transgender Harry Potter. However, in the time since this was posted, Rowling has voiced a series of views that have been described by many as transphobic, making her an extremely controversial figure. In the wake of it all, this post is now deeply ironic. I hope the four guys who make up the group, whose names don't matter, are putting money away for the future, the near future, because KISS won't be around long. May 27th, 1974. The Seattle Daily Times stated that KISS the band wouldn't last long in the 70s, and that they should be saving their money for when they flop. They are still touring to this day, which shows the article is wrong. They have been touring for almost more than 50 years, which proves the article wrong, and they are all rich. They also have lots of merchandise and a huge fan base. Egg and Wine Diet, 1970s Vogue. Uh, breakfast, one egg hard boiled, one glass of white wine. Lunch, two eggs hard boiled, uh, but poached if necessary, two glasses white wine, black coffee, dinner, five ounce steak grilled with black pepper, lemon juice, remainder of white wine, <laughs> good lord, and black coffee. A Netflix comedy special, Ellen DeGeneres, relatable. She won't be using her daytime voice. Oh man. I want Scotland to secede just because not enough historical events have happened in my lifetime and I want to see one. Uh. In my Facebook status from 2014, I lamented not having enough experience enough historical events in my lifetime. Looking back at the events from 2020 to 21 especially, most can agree that we have collectively experienced enough for one lifetime. Imagine having EDP as your babysitter. I had to find out why this aged like milk, and uh, I just want to put it on record, I am very, very upset. 20 women have accused actor and filmmaker Noel Clark of sexual harassment and bullying. Not Mickey from Doctor Who! I actually had no f***ing idea about this, and I am, I am upset again. Coloring page from a 1996 Looney Tunes kids activity book. Ah. Yikes. <laughs> Hitler's press secretary didn't approve of his mustache. Quote, stop worrying about it, said the Fuhrer. If it's not in fashion now, it will be soon because I'm wearing one. Hmm. Sarah Huckabee tweets, good friend Josh Duggar introducing my dad, Governor Mike Huckabee, at FLS 2014. It's good to be back in Iowa. Josh Duggar was recently arrested by the feds for possession of sexually explicit material of minors. God damn it. If you drink soda on the regular, don't tell me shit about my drug habits cause you're gonna die first, lol. Oh, oh man. Dr. Pizza tweets, anime is for pedos. Anti-Trump journalist Dr. Pizza arrested for child sex crimes. From a New York newspaper in the 1950s. If a woman needs it, should she be spanked? Excuse me? I strongly support drug testing for welfare recipients. Applying for welfare is voluntary. If you don't want to get tested, don't apply. There is a story out now about how Maddie G was doing a bunch of coke with hookers. This was a tweet about how drug testing should be done for welfare recipients. Teenage Florida man hacks his high school. Emails everyone urgent announcement about mandatory penis inspections in accordance with Florida Penal Code 69. Your memories on Facebook. Uh, we thought you'd like to look back on this post from five years ago. Please don't draw Kylo Ren and Rey making out. For all you know, that's his cousin or sister, and kissing your sister does not need to be something that runs in this family. Thank you. Yikes. The bot says I need to explain, so basically during the early days of the new Star Wars movies, people were drawing a lot of Kylo and Rey online, but we didn't know exactly who they were yet. I was pretty sure they were going to be related, so it made younger me uncomfortable. Spoiler, at the end of the latest episode, Rey and Kylo are a thing, and not in fact related at all. 
Yeah, I I was upset. I, I hate the Rise of Skywalker so much, but that's a rant for another time. So as a joke, this student emailed out that the entire school was gonna have a mandatory penis inspection. At the time, this was obviously absurd, but now in some Republican states, bills that were aimed to ban transgender women from participating in female sports has led to 100% legal genital inspections of minors. Not nice. Fucking gross. Friends, 20 years later. What will they look like? The year is 2024. Do you know who your friends are? Star uses computer magic to foresee their futures. Uh, <laughs> not quite, no. Goodbye Netflix, hello Blockbuster. <laughs> Oh, good one. Good one. Remember when you could have bought Netflix for only 10 or 11 million dollars? Yeah, that was a mistake. Bitcoin down 270 a pop. So glad I didn't buy in on that mess. I am such an idiot. Hey bud, get in on Dogecoin. Trust me, it's gonna be worth it. Apple iPhone now real. Oh my god! I don't get it. Who's gonna want a phone that's as large as an iPod and looks like an iPod? Sure, it worked for music, but for a phone? Meh, this will never catch on. I'm reading this off an iPhone right now, so I guess, um, you're wrong, bud. I want to be a queen! We'll tell you if anything happens to Princess Di! Oh no, she died. Ah, uh, yeah, um... That's awkward, moving on! The Leaning Tower of Pisa is predicted to topple over between 2010 and 2020. A falling a tower of Pisa! I'm still a standing you dummy bug. Last Airbender teaser trailer released doesn't entirely suck. My friends, my friends, here's a fun fact about this movie. They changed Aang's name to Ang, so it'd be more realistic to the Chinese way of saying it. But wait! Wait, the castaway kid. <coughs> it might not be Chinese, I might be mistaken, but that is literally what happened. Jesus, what is wrong with Hollywood? Kim Kardashian knew Kanye was the one because of how he sleeps. Oh, are, are they getting married still? Are they divorced? I don't know what's happening with these two. I don't care. GTX 1066 gigabyte. Cyberpunk 277. I am worthy. And then we have Keanu's Reeves face looking like a pizza over here because of glitches. When is Grand Theft Auto 6 going to be released? Well, GTA 6 will probably be announced in 2018 and be released in 2019 or 2020, depending on if it's delayed. Dude, they're planning on using the entire United States map, if they can. It's a long ways away, I'm guessing 2022 if we're lucky. We're watching his house. Dana White reveals details about how he will catch illegal UFC streamers. Conor McGregor vs. Dustin Poirier live stream free links to UFC 257 fights spread online amid hyper piracy. Oh, it's almost as if we don't want to pay $200 to watch two people punch themselves, but we still want it for free. PS2 themed PlayStation 5 consoles are going on sale next month. PS2 themed PlayStation 5 console orders canceled after employees received threats. I hate the internet. I really do sometimes. I got death threats over a character I voiced because it wasn't the right way to voice it and you- th that's bad but this is worse. It's a design of a game console. Just don't order this version. For those who don't know, Bully 2 was cancelled. I'm so ready for Bully 2. Yeah, it got cancelled because of, you know, school bullying getting worse. I really would have liked to play it though. Dwayne Haskins, QB Ohio State. I think he's the best quarterback in this draft and it's a great pick for the Redskins. Getting a cheap quarterback to come in and push to start right away is a great move. Love this pick by the Redskins. Like Kyle Murray, he's a one-year wonder, but there's a lot of potential here. Great A. Hey Redskins, remember before you changed your name? Yeah, that happened. Posted this five months ago, not the joke anymore. To the angry hate mob in the comments, please re-educate yourselves on your biased language. Thank you to at Trent Stevenson for this infographic. Hashtag say no to racism. Stop saying PogChamp. The term PogChamp or Poggers is used by hate groups to attack minorities. This creates a toxic environment for minorities on streaming platforms and on internet forums. It was just a joke. You ruined my favorite meme of last two months, which was Ryuko being like, Aw, come here. I guess you can be my little PogChamp animation. That was great, and y'all ruined it. Twitter gaming is catching up on the backlog. What's the game that best describes you? Duke Nukem Forever. Oh, wait. Oh, oh, cyberpunk, you fools. You hurt yourself. Ninja leaving Twitch for Mixer and people thinking that this was going to be a huge blow to Twitch. Yeah, hey, he doesn't care. He still got paid his entire million of dollars bonus, and now he can go back to Twitch or wherever he's doing it. Even a million men could not conquer this island. Rear Admiral, oh god, I'm gonna murder this, 
K.G. Shinbazaki about the islands of Tarwa shortly before it was taken by 35,000 men. Well, you got some egg on your face, bud. How does that feel? This is what you're remembered for in history. I demand a Lady Gaga will disappear into oblivion soon. Anyway, so who cares option? Guess what, bud? She's like one of the most popular pop artists and singers of all time right now. Uh, six throws down, forever to go. <laughs> oh, oh, they look so happy. Except for Ken. She's definitely faking that smile. Look at it. There's evil behind those eyes. Eminem, after the other OGs retired, fell off or died. Well, I guess I'm in charge now. Um... I don't know, he kinda is, but kinda is it. Now people are disrespecting him. I don't really know where the fan base of Eminem is at these days. He still makes some good music, though. Hot take. We won't see Boba Fett again. He's retired to a simple life in the Dune Sea as evidenced by his sand person garb and weaponry. The last shot of Episode 9 was his final goodbye to the armor and his spiritual passing of the torch to Din. Ha! Now we're getting a whole Boba Fett season, baby! Whoa! Star Wars nerds for the win! Still can't believe all of my my friends are literally rats. Oh, bud, bud, that, that ain't aged as well as mini lads content. It still hasn't been released almost eight months later. The Doom Eternal original game soundtrack composed by Mick Gordon is now available to download for collected edition owners. The OST will hit Spotify, iTunes, and more in this coming week. Stay tuned. I've been trying to get my hands on this. The music from the game is killer. Get it? Because Doom's about killing people? Ha! That joke's gonna age like milk. <laughs> Welcome to Volt, Reddit Killer, Troll Heaven, and the Strange Face of Internet Free Speech. Can anti-censorship bring a community together? No, no it can't, friend. Reddit literally crashed the stock market. You're not going to stop it. Up until 2020, a town in Quebec, Canada was called Asbestos. Mmm, that's a good town right there. It's, uh, Asbestos is more like it. Look at that right in there, bud. Donald Mustard said, Still can't believe I can play Fortnite game on my phone, making some final tweaks and getting V1 ready to go. Hope you love it as much as we loved making it. Ha, you can't play that on iPhone anymore. They removed it, ha! Will Smith and Jaded Pinkett Smith. Hollywood marriages that make us believe in true love. <laughs> And now they're sleeping around on each other, but it's open marriage and it is true love still. So I guess this one kind of still works. Um, you guys, there isn't many people playing this game. Well, 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 I myself on my channel got millions of views from my Among Us videos. God, those were the good old days. I'm glad this game blew up. The creators deserved it. Be kind to one another. Ellen DeGeneres. Don't you mean Ellen DeGeneres, who's really a bad person? Yes. Yes, she is. Tokyo 2020, Mario and Sonic at the Olymp- Oh, never mind. They're gonna have to wear masks and not compete. Sometimes I'm even shocked how long we've been here. Battlefield 5 dies after two years. Battlefront 2 after three years and quite possibly the worst launch of any video game in history. I'm still standing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whoa, whoa. Star Wars Battlefront 2 is still lit. I was playing that the other day. There's still plenty of players. Wired. Sega's plan for world domination. Gotta go fast into bankruptcy. 20 overhyped games that flopped. We love video games, but occasionally there's a dud in the bunch. Here are some games that didn't quite work out as planned. I just hope Cyberpunk never ends up on the list like this. Well, it flopped in like reception wise, but it still made money. I'm not even kidding you. Even after giving the $60 refunds to like a third of their player base that asked for them, it still made millions. Look it up. It's still in the profit margin. Say what you will about Jobs, but at least he didn't defraud people. <laughs> <laughs> the next Steve Jobs, eight women who could own the future. <laughs> All right then, buddy. You shouldn't pre-order anything ever. Pre-ordering Cyberpunk 2077 is a safe bet. <sighs> yep, just like Keanu Reeves' face being sexy in that game is a safe bet. Aw, this was such a cute book, but now Ellen DeGeneres, a comedian and television star known for her kindness and generosity, is in it. Now we gotta throw it in the trash. Oh, no. Why UK fishermen feel betrayed by Brexit? Why British fishermen are excited about Brexit. Yeah, that didn't go over well. I pray we never ever get video conferencing from a 1977 commercial about how easy it is to work from home with the internet. Heh. <laughs> 
<laughs> We're living that now, buddy. Living the dream. Community Day voting is coming back and with some changes. Votes will be collected via Twitter poll hosted on our official channels. The two Pokemon with the most votes will be featured in June and July. Vote for Weedle Punk. Hey guys, you should do a collab with Pokemon Go. Are you saying our game is going to crash a lot? <laughs> Dude, it's gonna do more than crash. I'm gonna phase into the ground while walking in a straight line. American author Jenny Hand states that January 6th might be a nice day on Twitter. Just a few hours later, the Capitol building is raided. I don't want to jinx anything, but I think it might be a nice day on Twitter today. Ooh, that didn't go too well for you, did it, bud? Ooh. If you can't even clean up your own room, who the hell are you to give advice to the world? His room's not that dirty, dude. He's got some knickknacks and like some a one trash in the corner and then an open file cabinet. Come on, cut him some slack. Good sports. Athletes, your kids can look up to. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh no! This book cover displays former MLB players like Mike McGuire as an athlete you kid can look up to. It would later come out that McGuire was using steroids to aid his performance, and he has since come to be seen as one of the faces of the PED endemic that swept baseball in the late 1990s and early 2000s. Ah, that's great. Dragon Ball Z Abridge will return in Season 4. Oh wait, we're never gonna get to see the Boo Saga, are we? No, we're not! My childhood is ruined. Samson mocks Apple for ditching power adapters with iPhone 12 lineup. Included with your Galaxy. Sure it is, bud. Stands, a group of people trying to meet other people with similar interests while expressing this interest through shared morals, love, and creativity. Dream was taken. Um, bud, that was not what you should be saying. Sony Pictures to release Spider-Man 4 on May 6, 2011. Oh, really now? <laughs> Actually, this really was supposed to happen, but Sam Raimi didn't end up wanting to do it. Sony still wanted it. From a 2009 article about the world in 2020, politics make way for the face of experience by Andy McSmith. It is January 2020. The leaders of the main parties have set themselves an exhausting schedule of public meetings where, in a throwback to the early 1980s, they will make speeches in person in front of live audiences. <laughs> the forthcoming 2020 general election is being billed the back to the future election, or as some pundits are saying, it will be the first post-internet campaign. Blogs, Facebook, Twitter, text messages, and email are now seen as middle-age obsessions. People under the age of 25 like to talk to their friends directly. No, we don't! Not via digital machine. That is why voters in the age group who are more engaged in politics than their elders are unwilling to vote for anyone they have not seen or heard in person. What were you smoking when you wrote this? This was wrote in what, frickin' 2009? Kids were obsessed with the internet that, back then just as much as they are now. They don't care about talking to people in person. We have Call of Duty Model for two in this year. Disney stock slide. Oh, friends, friends, you don't realize they're gonna own every company. Give it 10 years, I swear to God. Anti-war poster from 1944, forecasting the future events of the Italian campaign. The war ended the following year. Speaking of timetables, <laughs> I don't know what's so funny. That thing just reminds me of a Yu-Gi-Oh card or Skeletor like, nah I'm going to take over the boot continent. <laughs> I know it's not a continent. That's the joke. Skeletor wasn't smart. Newark police, no officer fired a single shot in 2020. Thanks to de-escalation program. They shot and killed someone within the first hour of 2021, though. Good job, Newark. I'm proud to say I lived there once. Oh, wait. No, I'm not. So, one Bitcoin, 500k within three years? Huh? <laughs> if not, I will eat my d*** on national television. John McAfee. <laughs> You're gonna be eating that stuff. You lied to us. I'm gonna, I'm gonna tweet you, buddy. I'm gonna tweet you. Everything that can be invented has been invented. George H. Dole, 1899, Commissioner U.S. Patent Office. My friend, you know what we invented? The teddy bear. If you don't know what that is, it's a little pad you put on your seatbelt to keep it from chafing your chest. Look it up. We also have a golf club you can literally pee into on the golf course, and it comes with a little apron. I'm not even kidding you. <laughs> Spongebob. So it comes to this. Saw the Spongebob premiere Saturday. Can you say completely pathetic? Looks like Nick is running out of ideas. The show is doomed. All right, please, Spongebob Squarepants. Now shut up and drive Ren Ripple Salesman. What? What? 
<laughs> what is that last sentence? The Joker once said this in a past comic. It used to mean a clumsy mistake back then. Meanwhile, at the Joker's hideout. So, they laugh at my boner, will they? I'll show them. I'll show them how many boners the Joker can make. I'll show Batman the boner. I'll show Harley Quinn the boner. Even though she wasn't alive in this iteration of Batman quite yet because she's an original character from the animated series. I'll show you all my boners. <laughs> I'm such an idiot. 40 Winks were planned to release officially on N64, but never released. What is 40 Winks? Coming soon to your N64 from GT Interactive. Feels like a crappy horror game. My Stadia tattoo, Stadia and the community have made an everlasting impact on my life. <laughs> never have I been so excited and firm believer of a platform and the technology. The community is one of the most loving and welcoming filled with amazing people. Yeah, it's not like Stadia went out of business or anything. Haha. <laughs> and it I got to die. For some reason, I doubt Meta is hiring. Meta front-end developer professional certificate. Yeah, bro, uh, Meta is definitely not hiring. They fired a whole bunch of people. Sonic Frontiers video game. It's a 72% from Metacritic. Sega says it's targeting high review scores for Sonic Frontiers. I mean, 72 is pretty high <laughs> compared to other Sonic games. It's hard to be a Sonic fan sometimes. 1994 gaming forum comment. Does anyone know of an SNES emulator? for the PC, the one poster from blank is a hoax and the file has been removed. I'm searching for an emulator to play console games on the PC. Wow. Wow, it's almost like we created those with ease now called Raspberry Pis. Or something like that. Posted this yesterday and he won to die. Only win Mercedes are getting this year. Ha 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 Yeah, baby. <laughs> sure, sure. This 2002 competition where you had to find the ugliest person and take a picture of them, winner received a year's supply of GameCube games. Ugly Compo! Yeah, this won't age poorly at all. It's not like it's gonna hurt people's feelings or create social anxiety for certain people the rest of their lives. An article about the oldest coaches from June 2011. He would be forced out four months later. Joe Paterno, 84. The legendary 84-year-old Penn State football coach has called the plays in Happy Valley for 61 years, and then he got fired four months later. <laughs> Couldn't make it to 62 or 69, could you, old man? Eat more fish. They feed themselves. USA, 1915. Save the products of the land. Eat more fish. They feed themselves by eating their themselves by eating their young. <laughs> oh, man. All these uneaten sandwiches. Each time they get a hit, take a bite of your hoagie. Yep. Uh, looks like, uh, looks like, uh, Mr. Bone starved to death. I guess he's living up to his name now. Dota 2, the international champions team, Spirit, just got eliminated by Boom Esports after one of their members used this chat line in-game in their game. See you later, nerds. Ah, yeah, that didn't end too well for him, did it? After the Netflix miniseries, people have been dressing up as him. There have even been reports of eBay and other stores banning Jeffrey Dahmer costumes. You don't see people dressing up as Jeffrey Dahmer. Oh, my friend. That's what happens when you cast an attractive actor to play a psychopath. More doctors smoke camels than any other cigarette, October 1946. More doctors smoke camels than any other cigarette because they also want to die because the 1940s and there's nothing good to look forward to. Jimmy Savelle has died. Rip Uncle Jimmy. I guess he must have fixed it for you. I got a milk, a, a cow blindfold. What? Oh, uh, oh boy, that did not age well at all. Not at all. Idiot, imbecile, and moron were legitimate classifications for mentally disabled people 100 years ago. Yay! I'm an imbecile! Yay! <laughs> a title of one of Alec Baldwin's match games, he came out in a prison jumpsuit as well. Shooting blanks! Alec Baldwin it Oh no, shooting blanks. Oh no! <laughs> I bet my left testicle that Apple will not put USB-C in iPhones ever. Well, you've only got to write one if you're lucky now, pal. You want to bet me uh, they won't change it again in five years? I'll bet you my right testicle. Yeah, <laughs> about that. Square Enix president hopes that the Marvel's Avengers success will best Insomniac Spider-Man. Oh, no. No, no, no. No, 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 no. How many copies they'd sell? One? <laughs> 
South Carolina won 63-38. This was the pregame prediction. Yep, great predictions right there. Still waiting for the second film in this endless franchise. Ghostbusters franchise going to be endless, promised producers. Except this movie did not do well and was not that good, but also not that bad. It was just middle of the road, so we're not getting a sequel. We're getting a sequel to the reboot in 2020, though. 2022, sorry. Starting early next year, Netflix will begin cracking down on sharing an account outside one household. Love is an addiction. Love is sharing a password. Unless, of course, you're not paying for premium accounts. F you, you poor motherfuckers. We're Netflix. We're never going out of business. Yeah, they're going out of business. I'm calling it. Give them five years. Slashdot, when the iPod was first announced, the iPod ended up being a massive success for Apple. Meanwhile, the creative nomad has been largely forgotten. <laughs> What's a nomad? <laughs> Guess it walked away to go explore the United States. Get it? Nomad? <laughs> German radioactive toothpaste. Hmm, radio cast is zest cream. Put it in your mouth and you will glow. If Saudi wins, I'm cutting off my balls. Oh no, my balls. <laughs> I posted this comment as a sarcastic joke. Several hours later, the party I was invited to got canceled because the hosts were feeling sick. We're writers. We don't go to parties. <laughs> it got canceled. Vanguard tanked relatively for a card game. Call of Duty Vanguard writers hope to make two sequels to the game. Whoa, I forgot Vanguard existed. I'm not even gonna lie. <laughs> this posted champ from 1985 celebrating email. Australia passed electronic mail. It definitely won't put us out of business. I, uh, came across this certain spelling of a Christmas song in my brother's book. Nothing for Christmas. That's what I'd be doing. Nothing all alone for Christmas inside my booth looking at hentai. Betting on Ben Simmons. He scored seven points. I bet 50 bucks on Ben Simmons to make a three tonight. At 834 odds, I win over 400 bucks if Ben has at least one 3 p.m. <laughs> one 3 p.m. I also put a couple hundred on Ben to score eight or more total points. In case anyone wants a little something extra to cheer for this game, pray for me. <laughs> You're not getting dog squat, dog. Why did Activision, EA, and Ubisoft break away and build their own stores from scratch because it's way more profitable to sell their games that way than give 30% to a store, <laughs> you dummy. And that's why Fallout is fiction because Queen will never die. Well, she's dead, but the band will never die. Mama! They don't put pretty people like me in jail. Elizabeth Holm brushed off pain risks. They don't put pretty people in jail, and guess what? You're in jail now. Asthma relief cigarette. <laughs> yes. The strumadama leaves really help my asthma. Well, we know how was good Chris Pratt's impression. I play devil's advocate and remind everyone we have yet to hear Chris Pratt's actual voice for Mario. He's good at impressions, so hopefully he does a decent job. Hey guys, 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 I know we're all on like the hate Chris Pratt train, but a lot of times as a voice actor, you don't get to like choose the type of performance you put in. You'll give them a great take that's like, wahoo! But uh, they'll, they'll choose the wahoo, I'm Chris Pratt, just because that's what directors do sometimes. Twitter tells employees there are no plans for layoffs. <laughs> we're just going to shut down this cesspool of a website. Best caption wins, go. Fire. Did, did Jay Leno's garage burn down or something? I don't know. Well, and not forever now. I was more than happy with Henry Cavill's appearance as the Witcher. He's a real professional, just as Viggo Mortensen gave his face to Aragon in The Lord of the Rings, so Henry gave his to Geralt. It shall be forever so. Well, no, he, he quit or got fired. I don't really know. But also, he's not Superman anymore, so sorry, Henry Cavill. I guess you can cry into your millions of dollars. This wager on who gets to keep James Corden. World Cup fans say loser of England versus USA must keep James Corden. <laughs> this has become the biggest game in the history of football. Great. We're both stuck with him. <laughs> NME's review of Kendrick Lamar's To Pimp a Butterfly. This is possibly the most critically acclaimed album of the past 20 years. Has Lamar followed a classic with another classic? Not quite, but in laying his demons and his contradictions bare, he has stayed true to his formidable talent. You feel good about yourself, NME? Probably not. That's like people who say Eminem was a one-hit wonder. <laughs> uh, yeah, totally. And now he's back. Permanent suspension of at real Donald Trump, but Elon gave it back to him. And I just want to say Elon and me have very big hands. And we're back on Twitter. 
until it shuts down in like five days. Top response to Aida for warning my friend about naming their baby Karen. YTA, you really think it's going to matter when the kid's older? It's a meme. Oh, and for anyone pregnant or planning to have kids, this is why you don't reveal the name until they're born. Someone's always got something stupid to say, no matter what. Yeah, precisely, internet memes come and go in a flash. I think OP is massively exaggerating the likelihood that the associations will stick around. Karen will forever be a Karen, bro. Like, you don't understand. All the kids call on Karens, Karens now. We'll call Karens, Karens when they're older also. An ad from the 1950s gives tips on how to dispose of batteries. Burn old flashlight batteries. I, you know what, I, I for some reason thought it was gonna be like, put them up your butt, but that'd be too much of a good time for the 1950s. Just burn them. Burn your batteries. Never give up on your dreams. I wanna be the very best like no one ever was. Never won a single Pokemon tournament in over 15 years. And I'll never be cast out of the anime. Overwatch servers went down for good to make way for the sequel. 245, server shut down, Blizzard, lol, Blizzard is not EA. D2 servers are running up to this day. <laughs> yeah, just forget about Overwatch. Remember when they like shut down Overwatch not safe for work stuff, even though it was keeping the game alive? That's really funny. Power changes everything. Oh, I forgot he was in this game. Oh no. <laughs> Thank God Reddit doesn't have profile pics. After the terrible taste at the Dexa series final lift, it's time to get back on that Game of Thrones beach. <laughs> At least the Dexter like follow up series was pretty solid to people, I think. This is coming from the same people who can't set up a pit of foam blocks at TwitchCon. Smarter makes the fastest faster. Yeah! Fastest makes faster. Uh, you can't make fastest faster. What the hell? Persona 5 was delayed until 15 September 2016 because around the original release date, the game wasn't finished yet. That's why Elon is successful. He doesn't let his ego get in the way of progress. I, I personally like the idea that Elon bought Twitter just to make it tank because I hate Twitter and I hope it goes out of business. <laughs> As of today, the show is now streaming on the service. Why not? Why is Bear in the House not on Disney Plus? Well, maybe this video helped them bring it to it. I mean, they also got like the Otter Jelly Show on their Disney Plus. Now let's go. Taylor Swift says otherwise. The era of albums debuting with 1 million copies is officially over. <laughs> Tell that to Adele. Freaking Drake almost hit that. Not to mention Taylor Swift blew records out of the water forever that'll probably never get surpassed for physical sales. The Mercedes F1 team had an exciting new sponsor for 2022. Bringing our fans closer to the team, we're proud to launch the first in a series of NFT drops powered by FTX official. I had a BlockFi credit card. Thanks, FTX. All those uh, Bitcoin percents are gone now. Microsoft, five years from now, we will have a commercial quantum computer. No, you will not. What would happen, hypothetically, if Kanye West won the presidency? Yeah, bro, he, he didn't win. That, that's it. There's no hypothetical. It's not going to happen. Cyclone Debbie would actually go on to cause one of the worst events of coral damage in recent history. Could Cyclone Debbie stop the Great Barrier Reef bleaching? No, no, it just ruined more of the reef. How's the turntables turn? Resident Evil, I saw you being born and I saw you die. Yep. <laughs> Sad but true for all of them. A commenter from 1999 claimed Natalie Portman would not be in Star Wars Episode 3. She was. Uh, in one of her... That is correct. She will not be in Episode 3. The character of the Queen will be in Episode 3, but will not be played by her. These are her own words. Sure they are, buddy. Sure. Not anymore after being dropped by almost every brand that used to work with him. Kanye West? Oh, yep, nope, DJ Academics, okay. Kanye West said he put Drake, Kim Kardashian, Kid Cudi, Push T, Jay-Z, Travis Scott all on a group text message and told them all, I'm worth more than all you... Uh, yeah, yeah, um, not worth more than Kim Kardashian, sadly. Um, he's a psychopath, but like... I don't know, man. I don't follow celebrities. Most, if not all, Denny's location have discontinued their chocolate lava cakes. A dinner is not a dinner without some sort of chocolate lava cake on the dessert menu. I have a Denny's about 10 minutes from here. I've never eaten there because it's Denny's. And Denny's is gross. But I kind of want to see if they have chocolate lava cake now. Waited 64 years to get to the World Cup. Out in three games. Whale Star can't wait to knock England out six years after wearing three lines. Well, he got knocked out. Also, I play a game and I lost all my trophies because I picked the wrong team to win the final. Oh well, have a good day.